Okay, what is the potential energy of two protons which are 10 to the negative 10 meters apart? So here I've got two protons. They're separated by a very tiny distance of 10 to the negative 10 meters. And we know that they have potential energy because they want to move. We know that two positive charges want to get further away from each other. They want to repel. So there's some energy, some potential energy stored in those electric fields of those two particles. Now the formula is very simple for potential energy. If you see the word energy, potential energy is K, Q1, Q2, all over R. Now, energy is not a vector. You either have it or you don't. But the thing about energy in electrostatics is you have to put the sign of the charge in exactly the way you see it. So if both charges are positive, two positives make a positive, I'll get a positive potential energy. Similarly, if both charges are negative, two negatives multiplied together still makes a positive, I'd get a positive potential energy. They'd still want to repel. However, if one charge is positive and one charge is negative, doesn't matter which, then I get a negative potential energy they want to attract. So let's put in our values exactly the way we see them. So 9 times 10 to the 9, our usual Coulomb's constant. Charge 1 is the charge of a proton, which is the same as the charge of an electron, only positive. 1.6 times 10 to the negative 19. Same with charge 2, 1.6 10 to the negative 19 coulombs. All of that divided by the separation, which is 10 to the negative 10. Now, a lot of people on their calculators will put this in wrong. They'll go 10 and then hit their exponent button and enter negative 10. What you've done there is entered 10 times 10 to the negative 10, which is confusing. So think of this as 1 times 10 to the negative 10. So you're going to put in 1 exponent negative 10 to get your answer correct. So when you do that, you get a positive energy of 2.3 times 10 to the negative 18 joules.